Hi, I'm Derev and Dave, and today I'm going to show you how to put together the workshop easel. Let's get to it. Um, it has nine pieces of wood. We have uh, four bolts, two long, two short, some little lugs, an Allen key, nine long screws, four teeny weeny screws that go with this ratchet, uh, a spring, and a little insert for the spring, and a black knob. And I'll show you what to do with all that as we go along. Right, first thing we need to do is grab this centerpiece with the ratchet on it and then we need to work out which are the legs which you'll see have a little bit cut out in the on, which will be on the inside so there's two of those a left and right and we grab the ratchet place it in the middle and the legs to either side with the cutaway on the inside so it faces on the inside. Then we have a long and a shorter piece of wood. The shorter piece goes at the top, the longer piece goes down the bottom. We grab this, flip this over with the ratchet here, make sure that this cutaway here is on the same side as the ratchet and this cutaway here inserts on the top of this centerpiece. And then we have the two legs, the screw holes are already there, they will turn over and, in fact no they won't, we'll flip this whole thing over, that will be so much easier, and they will line up with the holes on the legs. Then we grab four screws and a Phillips head screwdriver, and put two screws in this side and two in this side which is what I'm going to do right now. Now I've put two of the four screws in. Before we put the other two in, we'll just insert this bottom piece. These four top screws are in. We'll just lift this up and turn this wing nut to hold that secure. And then we put two screws into this part here to secure it. And again, the holes are there, you just have to find them. Okay, done. Now, next part. You get the two shorter screws, or bolts, I guess we call them, and these, what I'll call nuts. And you might find you need a screwdriver as well, you may not. And these hold these legs to the bottom bar. So you insert one of the nuts into there. Just this might be where the screwdriver comes in handy, get it sort of horizontal with the bar. Insert the bolt and that should a little bit of trickery. And the Allen key. Screw in. And then we just flip it around. And to the other side. So that's the A-frame part done. I'm working out sweat here. Woo! Next, 
we have this uh, center piece that needs to be done. Okay, this is where the black piece comes in. Insert this at the top. And simply put that through and that screws in and wedges up against the wood. Stable there, then when you're using it, you can adjust it and just screw it down. So we'll just leave it at the top here for the moment. So we've got our little top piece on here, and then we're going to attach this, what I guess is our uh, canvas holder, onto the middle bar. So it should have three large screws left. We're going to put them into here. And it's pretty easy, there's a diamond shape there, and you just match up the holes. Now, what we're going to do is insert this piece, which has a little V there, to the top of the easel. And after we've inserted it, we're going to attach this ratchet to the bottom part. Now, we've got four tiny screws, which we'll use for this. There's two screw holes. next thing to do is to insert the two longer of the bolts through these holes here then flip the whole thing over keeping the bolts there we have this bit of wood which is going to fit on the top but before we pop it on the top, we have this spring and piece of metal. Put the piece of metal in one end of the spring and insert the spring into the hole with the metal piece facing out there. Then these two holes here go onto here, these two bolts, and once they're through, Voila. Easel. Done.